guys? Shion KH352 here with a Black Ops 3 beta review. So I just got the beta code a little while ago and I've been playing it for a couple of days. And um, it's been really, really laggy. And um, you know, I kind of put it aside and waited a few days. And uh, I decided to play it again today. And, um, good thing I was recording, because, you know, I thought about doing a video and wasn't really sure, but it recorded, so I figured, why not? <clears throat> now, I like, I like Black Ops 3, you know, it's pretty cool. Um, Black Ops 2 was, um, you know, Black Ops 2 was definitely the best. Um, you know, the zombies, they didn't cheat and, um the, you know, the multiplayer gameplay wasn't that bad and wasn't that laggy at all. Like, well, well, on certain occasions it was a little laggy, but not by much. Um, not that bad after all. Um, but yeah, it was cool. You know, they had the maps and the add-ons and <clears throat> things like that. And then, you know, there was talk of Black Ops 3 coming out and everybody was all excited. And, you know, it's a beta, so obviously there's bound to be, um, you know, there's bound to be some lag within the beta because there's so many people playing it, you know? So that, I mean, that's a given. But, my god. <laughs> oh my god. The lag is real. <laughs> the lag is real. Um... I, I will go over, like, the goods and bads, um, the goods and bads of, of this, and the good thing, um, uh, the good things, um, I, I like the features that, um, that they have, like, the, there's, like, some new, you know, they got some new guns, and that's really cool, I like that, um, they have, uh, well, I haven't really unlocked much, because I can't really get very far, uh, as you can probably see. This is me playing, um, and, um, yeah, it, they get some new guns, and the em different emblem things look really cool. I, ha I haven't figured out how to, how to make an emblem yet. I don't know what level I have to be to actually do that, if you even can on the beta, I'm not really sure. I think you can, but I'm only level two, um, so you probably haven't unlocked that yet. Um, <clears throat> as you can see, that guy, <laughs> that person there, did that, you know, that jumping thing, which is um, kind of what they had in uh, Advanced Warfare, and uh, I like that. That's really cool. I like that they implemented, um, they implemented that, you know, double jumping thing that they had in Advanced Warfare into Black Ops 3. That's really cool, and, um, it does seem to help a lot when you're trying to get, you know, get some distance between you and the other person. Um, the only problem is it doesn't help when you go to do that and when you go to do it, it lags completely, and then you go falling to your death in the water. Uh, <clears throat> that's the only thing I don't like. Um, um, I like the fact that you get to play as a female, at, like in Advanced Warfare. That's really cool. I'm glad they added that in there. Um, what I don't like is that I wish that they had uh, more females to choose from. Uh, there probably are once you unlock them. I'm assuming. I think you. I don't know if you have to act like uh, unlock them by doing a certain thing in the game, doing certain things, or like uh, buying them in the store. I'm not really sure. There might be more, but. Uh, I kind of wish they had more to choose from in the beta here. That, you know, that would have been nice, because 
as you can probably see, there's like, you know, the people that choose the female characters, like, all the same female character running around shooting themselves, you know. <laughs> and, um, but I mean, other than that, other than that, that's pretty cool. See, as you can see there, I'm level two and not that great. I mean, I'm normally I'm really not that good at shooting games like this, you know, but I, <laughs> I'm better than what you see right here. I'm definitely better than that. I have one kill. I'm definitely better than that. Um, it's just the lag was just so bad. So bad that I could barely even do anything. Like, it just is ridiculous. Just, it looks like, I, like, you know, I come up to somebody and try to shoot them and they end up killing me. It, and, I don't know. That's just really stupid. Um, but, uh, what else? Um, I like the... I like the new maps. I like the new maps. Um, and uh, there was something really. If you, uh, I'm not sure if you pre if you pre-order, you get the special map, or you get some sort of zombies map or something. Uh, if there are zombies, I'm not really sure. Um, but you get some kind of special map. Um, for pre-ordering. I mean, if, you know, if I actually, you know, like the game when it's an actual game and not a beta, then I'll probably end up getting the season pass and so everything will be free, you know? I like the maps that they have in the multiplayer area. They, you know, a lot more, um, a lot brighter than on Black Ops 1 or 2. And, um, <clears throat> you know, so you can kind of see everybody that's coming at you, which is a good thing. Except for the snipers, I can't see them, but, but besides Kills that, not that bad. Um, Friendly UAV inbound. but really though, like, the lag is just, has been so bad Advised. during this beta. And, you know, like I said, I, I know it's a beta, it's bound to have lag, but... <laughs> This is so bad. This is so bad. Like, as you can, like, look at this. I'm, like, running through the door, and it's just, the gun in my person's hand is just hemorrhaging because it's, you know, it's trying to, to move, and, and, and the game just won't let it. Losing C. Hostile UAV above. See, look at this. Just when you think I'm gonna kill this guy, right? No. See, look. That double motion there. Try to kill the guy, and then I end up dying. Isn't that great? Of course not. <laughs> you best believe I was swearing like a sailor while playing this. It was just... Ugh. Ah. Hostile UAV above. But yes, you know, I mean, aside from, like, the horrible lag messing up my jumping and, you know, me falling to my Secure death, <laughs> not, hey, not down. that bad. I mean, I will Close give it a. that, you know, it's, it's, um, one of the nicer Black Ops games that I've seen, you know, because, because, oh, and because, it has that advanced warfare feature, you know, that you can, that you do that little double air jump and you can kind of get away and put some distance between you and the enemy. But, like I said, with the horrible lag that's in this beta right now, it doesn't even really matter. <laughs> Look at that. It just fell through a hole. It's horrible. And, uh, you know, there's been points in here, like, you pro you'll probably see, like, you, like, you don't even know where they are, because it's, like, 
You think that they're far from you or something and they're really right there because it just kind of like double jump lags. I I don't know what I don't know how to explain it. Probably, you know, once I play the game, it's gonna take me a while to <coughs> to get used to it. You know, it's, I'm still having trouble get used to it. I can't even play Destiny correctly on the PS4 because of the controller, and uh, you know, so I mean, it's something to get used to playing again because I haven't played Black Ops in so long. Um. You know, I only hope that the actual game will kind of redeem C. itself from the beta. Um, I mean, I don't know if anyone else has had any kind of lagging Don't issue, you. but <laughs> as you can see right here, this is just plain ridiculous. <laughs> what you call lag trolling. Just when you think you're gonna kill that person and they end up shooting you. It's just ridiculous. And, you know, but I mean, I, I don't know. It's, it's just ridiculous. That's, that's really the only way to put it. The lag is ridiculously real. Um, Bravo, lockdown. But yeah, uh, I played, let's see, I played a little bit of Team Deathmatch and... You know, that was laggy. I played a little bit of, um, think, Kill Confirmed, and not just, ugh, did, I tried eat, you know, a little bit of Team Deathmatch, Kill Confirmed, Domination, and each one was probably just as laggy as the next. Um, Team Deathmatch was probably the worst lag I've experienced, and Domination, not... Not as bad as Team Deathmatch, but it's pretty close. I don't, I don't dare try free for all yet. <laughs> mm -mm. Um. Uh, let's see. I like the new emblem cards that they give you. That's cool. Um. Uh, I don't know. Like I said before, I don't know if you can make an emblem. Uh, yet, I think you can, I'm not really sure, I'll have to figure it out and, like, really buckle down and try to, uh, to, uh, get some kills to actually make an emblem. <laughs> Look at the map, like, I played on the snow area as well, and that was really nice, uh, you know, I, I like the look of it. The gra graphical-wise, it's really good, you know. And uh, it was, it was, you know, done pretty well. I like the new, you know, the new machines that you get to, you know, to, to drop on the enemy. Uh, even though, as you can probably see, they're being used on me. <laughs> Not me using them. But besides that, I still like them. Um, uh, what else? Um... Yeah, I guess that's about it. I mean, the graphics are really good. Um, the, you know, the overall game is good, you know. It's Black Ops with a little bit of advanced warfare thrown in there, uh, which is good, unique. Um, overall, I would probably give this game um, three angry ladies out of five. <laughs> <laughs> just my little quick review and um yeah <laughs> like I said three angry ladies out of five so I hope you enjoyed it let me know what you think in the comments below uh, if you've played the beta or we've seen it or whatever and I'll see you guys next time